because the Lord sent me the death of Jerry Falwell that week. <laughs> and I thought, okay, I'm going to say what I think about him. And I made a few comments about his, his, uh, the origin of his ghastly career as a segregationist and a defender of racism, about his, his vulgar and cheap anti-Semitism, about his mad belief that the Antichrist is, is with us now and is already here and is an adult Jewish male. He's trying to lay off that bet by supporting the ugliest and stupidest elements in Israel who think they can bring on the Messiah by stealing other people's property, his shakedown artistry, his lying, his failure to levitate his ghastly tubby form into the heavens with the rapture, <laughs> instead being found slumped uselessly on the floor of his office in Virginia, uh, built on the, on the money uh, stolen from the credulous. And then I thought, well, I, I can go on in this vein for some time, but I'm, I think I really ought to say what I truly think about him. And I said, um, <laughs> now that he's gone, I have some advice for his grieving family. Give him an enema, you can bury him in a shoebox. <laughs> <laughs>